Growing up in a small community was pretty hard because there was not much to do. My eldest brother passed away who inspired me to play music. That kind of gave me a little bit of anger and it kept on building up, building up. Then I started doing smoking weed and I was doing bad stuff around the community, just getting into a lot of fights. Went off with a group of boys that was heading into town and started drinking with them. So I got into another fight and nearly got locked up. There's been lots of kids doing bad stuff in around Nirkala. Police just come lock them up straight away, not knowing who he is, what he is, what his background is, what his full story is, how he is hurt by putting him to jail and hurts him even more. Government is paying a lot of money, spending a lot of money just for them to be in jail. They could invest in something more positive. Music changed my life. It not only helped me rehabilitate myself, but it showed me some pathways for the future. We work with kids using music as the tool. We did some workshops in the local school here. So we've mentored some um, local younger fellas from Mirkala and took them on tour with us. It's been really great to pass on music talent to a younger generation. If there are more programs like that, in the community, we'd have young people strong in their culture and strong in themselves, not mucking about and ending up in jail. I now play in a band called His Journey. We released our first album a few years ago. We've played gigs around Australia and won some awards. At the moment, we're just working on our second album. It's been pretty, um, Life changing. <laughs>